With the all new sticky position property, you can enable any element to stay in the same position in your viewport while scrolling. And in this tutorial, I'm going to explain everything about position sticky. On this beautiful page, I want this product information element to stay in the same position or to stick while I scroll down these product images. However, if I preview right now, you can see that this does not happen. And the reason for this is that this product information element is now positioned relative. But we can change this to position sticky. And if you preview right now, you can see that this element does stick and stay in the same position while we scroll down these product images. Within position sticky, we can define under what circumstances the element sticks. And right now it's set to zero. And if we preview again, we can see that the element sticks when there's zero space between the top of the viewport and the element. If we go back again and change this to, for example, 64 pixels, you can see that the element will start to stick or remain in the same place when there's 64 pixels worth of space between the top of the viewport and the element. And before I end this video, it's good to know that a sticky element will not go outside the bounds of its container or the section it is in. So this product information element will only stick within this section. And that's it for position sticky.